Hey guys, so today we are going to talk about the structure of glycine. Now, glycine is the simplest amino acid there is because of its very simple side chain, the hydrogen. Now, before I go on to show you how to draw the structure of glycine, I actually want to tell you something very basic and very general about all amino acids. Now, and it's also true for all amino acids. So all amino acids will have two things in general. It would have a carboxylic acid group, which is drawn as a carbon double bonded to an oxygen and single bonded to an hydroxyl OH group. Uh, they would also have what we call an amino group, which is NH2. And like I mentioned, glycine is the simplest amino acid. It has the side chain hydrogen. So it's bonded to, uh, for a side chain, it's bonded to a single hydrogen atom. Now, drawing the structure is actually very simple. Uh, you draw your central carbon, so you draw your C. And as you know, carbon can form four bonds around it. So you draw four straight lines around the carbon and you just start placing all this group um, around the carbon. So let's just start with the carboxylic acid group. Now you could place it here, here, here. I would just place it on top. Doesn't really matter. So I have my carbon attached to my carboxylic acid group. So this is done. Uh, let's put the amino group. I want to place it here. You could place it here or here, it doesn't matter. And so this is done, and you have a remaining hydrogen. Let's just place it here. So you have your carbon attached to carboxylic acid, your amino group, and your smallest side chain, the hydrogen. And now you have one remaining spot, and that would be taken up by another hydrogen. So that's it. That's the structure of glycine. It has a carboxylic acid group on top, attached to an amino group, and for a side chain, it only has a hydrogen. Thank you.